guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how to use the rectangle tool um, and the push-pull tool. Alright, so first off, on SketchUp, you're going to hit, um, you're going to get the rectangle tool, which is over here, but honestly you guys got to get in the habit of using those um, keyboard shortcuts, so just hitting the R on your keyboard, which is the rectangle tool. Then, here's what you got to do. While you, you either click and drag, immediately drop it, hover over the center, and then go to your keyboard and type in the dimensions you want. So let's say I want 12 inches. 12 inches comma, 12 inches enter. And it's snapped to that size. That's one way of doing it. The other way of doing it is, let's say you take this, keep your finger on the mouse. See how it's still moving? Finger on the mouse, then on your keyboard, so it's gonna take a little bit of creativity on my end to view my keyboard because I can't actually hold the phone. Okay, so with my finger still on the mouse, I type in 12, hold down shift to get inches, inches, comma, 12, inches, enter. Then, let go of the mouse, and there it is. So then you have your your shape. Part two of this is using the push-pull tool. So all you gotta do, hit P on the keyboard for push-pull, then simply pull it up, your finger's still on the mouse, then let's say I want this to be 10 feet. Let's see, I know this is the, this is the fun part. 10 feet. Give me a second. I know this is tough, but believe me, I know as much fun as it is for you to watch here. All right, so I'm going to type in with my finger still on the mouse, 10 feet, enter. And see, voila, snaps to 10 feet. I let go of the mouse. There it is, push, pull. So you t pull it up. It's like here, let's say I want to pull this out uh, two feet. Finger still on the mouse. I hit two. Two feet. Enter. Let's hold it out for two feet. Okay. All right. That was really hard for me to video. I tried. Um, let me know if you have questions.